Thank you for watching this video. Today I will show you how you can export product from eBay to WooCommerce using the WooShark plugin. So once the plugin is installed, you can check the other videos to, to see how to install the plugin. <coughs> once the problem plugin is installed and it is activated, you can open it by clicking on this entry here and you'll get this page here. So this page allows you to import product to your store. Basically, you can import product by SKU, like the product ID, uh, the product URL, just copy paste the URL from eBay, or by searching keywords. For example, imagine uh, I want to search for Apple. I'm getting the list of results. Imagine you want to search by seller name, so you will need to paste the seller name here and the keyword should not be empty. It should be, for example, Apple in this case. So I will search Apple and I will get all the results of the seller here. This can be useful if you want just to get the result of some specific seller. So imagine I want to import this product here. So you have three buttons, import to shop, add to waiting list, product URL. So by clicking this one, you will get a model with all the uh, customization options with this one you will add them to waiting list and then you import them at once without the possibility to edit the product and this one you will visit the product on eBay by the way you can import the product directly from eBay by using the Chrome extension so there are two ways to import the product using the Chrome extension or the, the using the plugin on the today video, we are showing you how to import using the plugin. So I click on this button here. I get this model here. So on this model, you can edit the title, the short description. This is short description. I want to publish the product. I want to set it as featured product. I want to import the product to the categories game and shoes. I want to remove all this part of the description and also this part. I want to change the color and the style of this section. I want to remove this picture and keep only one picture. So I will keep only this one. And the variation, I will want to keep only two variations and I want to applicate a shipping price of $10. So this will increase the price, the original price and the sell price by 10. Good. And you can also apply one price for all variation. For example, I want to apply the sell price 200. So here I apply and I see 200 here. So this product will have only two variation. You can see here all the details, the images from here. I want to import these images, this option. If you have a lot of variation and you do not have a good hosting plan, this option can uh, lead to an issue out of stock or because like your, your WordPress server is not able to handle the request on time. So in order to import, to not have any issue with this, you need to increase your timeout, uh, PHP timeout, you need to increase the upload size. You can contact your host provider and they will help you for this. You can also apply a, pri a charm pricing. For example, I want to add 99 at the end. That's all. The specific attributes, so you can edit them, you can add some of them. I add store my store, the tags, stylish, and the reviews. You can add some reviews here to do. This can give some credibility to your user. Pretty. And I click import. You see a loading screen here, it will take some time. And the product has been inserted successfully. So I will go to the list of products. Already here, if you refresh the page, you see that the, the count increase and the product is here. You can already check the original product URL from here, from the product that has been imported. You can update the stock and the price from here. And you can insert some reviews from here. As you can see, this is the product that we have imported. It has all the details actually. So this is the description, the title that we have inserted. The variation, it's a variable product. So all this information here. 
the reviews that we have inserted the short description and the category you can find it here so if you open the product you find a really good product that it's there and already available on your shop for selling you select on option and you add it to your cart we are at the end of this video see you on next video bye